Cody, first and foremost, congratulations, our latest Centurion. How happy are you with that? Um, I think I'm delighted. I mean, we spoke about it a few weeks ago, didn't we? I think you could tell how, how happy and excited I was. I was. I've been waiting for this moment for a long time, so to get 100 games for a club that, that I love and, and, and I enjoy playing for is a real honour, so I'm real proud of myself. And to earn a clean sheet at a tough side like Chesterfield, it's a great performance today. 100%, I think the boys dug deep. Um, it's something that we've been working on, our defensive shape, and, and, and today it showed. Let's talk about you. Obviously, you've had a few weeks out with injury. How are you feeling? Your first 90 in a little while. So it's my first 90 in almost two months now. So, I mean, I'm proud of myself. It, it was tough. There were times today when, when my legs were starting to give up on me, but the boys kept me going and, and, and I'm really happy. How are you feeling fitness-wise? you feel OK? Nothing tweaked or anything like that? Um, no, no injuries, nothing to, to be concerned about. Obviously, I, I want to keep building my fitness, um, kind of keep my shirt back in the team now and, and build some momentum. Let's go through the game, obviously the first half, quite a resolute defence, obviously we've had a few chances early on and we've dealt with the Chesterfield pressure well as the first half went on. Yeah, I think we soaked it up, we know they're a good side, I mean obviously they brought um, Quigley in, who's, who's a big powerful boy and, and they've got Shimanga, so we know the, the quality they've got and the depth they've got in the squad, but I think we've done well today to nullify that. Of course, Quigley, you and Quigley has gotten a few tussles today as well, but you did well to just hold him off for most of the game. Yeah, I think, I mean, fair play to him. He, he made it tough for me today, but I think I made it as tough for him as well. So, yeah, good battle. And then obviously we move into the second half, goalless. And again, not too many chances for us, but we do do well defensively to see out, see out the point. Yeah, I think as long as we know we can... We know that we can take teams pretty much the whole way. I mean, obviously today we're still disappointed that, that you know it's only a point. It's good to get a clean sheet, but we would have liked to take all three today. I think that's the thing, isn't it? We're now boot, like we're improving on these results. Obviously, looking at the start of the season, we lost this game two 0 late on, but now we're seeing out the games defensively and earning a well-earned point. I mean, like you said, we're growing as a group. I mean, maybe this time last year, this time last year we may have conceded late on. You know, when they're thrown on obviously Denton, who's another handful. This time a year or so ago, we could have conceded, but we saw it out today. Obviously, the man you're smiling at was Mitch Walker there. Speak yeah. advice. He did well today and a few important saves for us. Yeah, I think Mitch is such a good guy around the ground, around the training ground. Um, so I'm happy to see him back in the team and, and keeping clean sheets. And obviously, the manager would have wanted to get a point or at least something from the game today. What was his message afterwards? Um, well done. Don't get too ahead of ourselves and, and still remember that we've got another tuss, tough test again on Tuesday against Southend and then we go again the next week. So, you know, just rest up and go again on Tuesday. Are you a movie shot? Look below for more information. Click here for the next video. Click here to subscribe.